नमस्कार लास्ट टाइम वी सा दी नंबर फोर्टी एंड हाउ ब्यूटिफुल आफ्टर लिस्निंग टू दिस विथ फील डिवोशन हाउ यू कैन बिकम एन एनलाइट एंड सो हाउ इट गिवस द अर्थ मीन्स मीनिंग टू युअर लाइफ दैट ऑल्सो वी सॉ ओके नाव ना तरी नगरांतरी वसीजे तरी नागराची होईजे तैसे व्यासोक्तीचे तेजे धवळीत सक इफ यू जस्ट इमॅजिन अ पर्सन लिव्हिंग इन अ बिग सिटी अँड अ पर्सन लिव्हिंग इन अ व्हिलेज सो द पर्सन लिव्हिंग इन अ सिटी बिकम स्मार्टर दॅन द पर्सन लिव्हिंग इन अ व्हिलेज इन सर्टन थिंग्स विच आर यु नो मोस्ट ऑफ द थिंग्स villagers don't get exposed to what the uh, the people living in the metropolitan faces okay because they become smart that is what it it is the meaning i'm giving you the direct meaning of this taise vyasok tise dhoile saka that is why if you listen to whatever bhagwan vedo vyas has said you become smarter in the field of spirituality maybe even in everyday life also you become smarter but mostly artha means the meaning of life lies in the spirituality adhyatma shastra living a devoted life so the meaning of this nagrantri vasije tari nagrik nagarachi hoise means you become smarter and smarter in the spirituality when you realize that oh all this is you know this is like a mirage everything is coming and going and you know it has got uh, though it is limited though there are you know there are certain things which we have to do as a kartavya because that is our duty in life but beyond duty whatever is there that is you know then you realize that this is the spirituality and rest of the things they get automatically get shaded out of our life automatically happens once you become a devotee okay so that is the real meaning of this because you become smarter and then somebody tries to distract your mind you don't listen to those things straight away that that is the real meaning over here kim prathama vaya sakai lavannachi navhari प्रकटे देशी आगळी अंगानांगी वेन यू बिकम यंग यू बिकम द मोस्ट ब्युटिफुल इन युअर लाईफ स्ट्रेट अवे एव्हरीबडी बिकम्स मोस्ट ब्युटिफुल इन हिज यंगेस्ट ऑफ द यंगेस्ट एज एज स्ट्रेट अवे दॅट इज द मिनिंग ना तरी उद्यानी माधवी घडे ते तर वनशोभेची खाणी उघडे आदिलापासून आपाडे जियापडे ओके इट मीन्स दॅट यु गेट नाना घनीभूत सुवर्ण तसे न्याहाळ इथं साधारण मग अहंकारी बरे पण निवाडू जावे यु सी इन जंगल्स द मोस्ट ब्युटिफुल थिंग्स आर द फ्लॉवर्स अँड ऑल दोज थिंग्स द ग्रीनरी अँड ऑल दोज थिंग्स सिमिलरली वेन यू गेट यु नो द लगड मीन्स यू गेट द बिस्किट ऑफ द गोल्ड बट इट इज नॉट सो ब्युटिफुल ॲज द ऑर्नमेंट्स आर ओके सिमिलरली तैसे व्यासोक्ती अहंकारले आवडे ते बरेपणे पातले ते जाणनी काय आश्रय आश्रयले इतिहासी सिमिलरली वेन व्यास महर महर्षी वेद व्यास भगवान वेद व्यास डिस्क्राईब्स एव्हरीथिंग ॲज अ जिस्ट इन हिज महाभारत मे बी एनी पुराण यू टेक भागवत पुराण धीस पुराण दॅट पुराण गरुड पुराण ऑर व्हॉट एर इट मे बी देर आर सो मेनी पुराण आज देर बट दे आर देअर but when its gist is explained by bhagwan vedo vas then it becomes you know really uh, like an ornament beautiful because we already saw because uh, in every word there is a huge amount of meaning inside it like uh, goddess sharda has entered into the mahabharat nana puratile pratishthe lagi saniv dhurini angi purane akhyan rupe jagi bharat aale lot of puranas have come inside this and they got people came to know the real meaning of them after listening to mahabharat straight away mhanuni mahabharat je nahi te nohi chi loki ti yene karane mhani pe pahi vyasot chistam jagat rayo means 
that is why Manuvindu means that is why there is nothing that is not there in Mahabharata. That is why Vaso Chishtam Jagatra means Uchishtam means whatever he has eaten, he is eating and speaking. His words get repeated or reflected in every of the knowledge in the world. Straight away. That is why is what is the meaning. I say Surasa Jagi Katha, Je Janmubhumi Paramartha, Muni Sangye Drupanatha Janme Jaya. So this is a beautiful, Suras means beautiful, Ras means Shantaras, Suras means ultimately beautifully Shanta means peace, in peace. Jagi means this world, Janmubhumi Paramartha means uh, Paramartha, Paramartha means the Param means ultimate, Artha means meaning to the life, living the ultimate, real, meaningful life that is Paramartha. Muni Sangin Drupanatha Janmeja. Uh, so, this is, you know, Vaishampayan Rushi was the person who was telling it to the Janmeja, the King Janmeja. So, he is telling it. Je Advitya Uttama Pavitreka Nirupama Parama Mangal Dhamma Avdharizo. Advitya, ultimate, Uttam, the best, Pavitra means uh, mo most and the best, most pious, piousest you can say in fact. <laughs> then uh, Nirupama, Upama, Upama means to compare, there is uncomparable. Param means ultimate, Mangal means the uh, pious eyes, Mangala Dhamma. Mangal Dham means the where the pious things lives, that house is Mangal Dham. That is what I am telling you. Ultimate, every, every word is ultimate. Imagine this is Naneshwari and imagine the Mahabharata, how beautifully they are written. Ata Bharati Kamal Paragu, Gita Kyu Prasangu, To Samvadala Shirangu Arjunesi, Natri Shabda Brahmabdi. Mathilesi Vyasabuddhi Nivadile Nivarathi Navanitahe. In this Mahabharat, Kamala Paragu, like the uh, most beautiful, the sweetest part of it is Gita Shastra in Mahabharat. That has been told by Sri Rangumis, Lord Sri Krishna to Arjuna. What is Gita? It is the Shabda Brahmadi. It is like Om Ekaksharam Brahma, like that. The gist of Mahabharata happens to be in Gita. And that Gita is like, you know, if you if you see, you know, the curd is there, that has been like this. Uh, you know, it has been churned like this. And then the Naunit means uh, the butter comes out, like that. After churning Mahabharata, what is, is there? The Gita is there. That Gita, I am going to tell now. And that has been told by Sri Ranga means Sri Krishna that I am going to recite over here. At the same time, trying to explain it as much as possible because that is so beautiful. And I'm, I'm, you know, I'm sure that uh, while explaining it, I am also going to be unison with the God. That is for sure. That is what uh, Bhagwan. Uh, uh, Mauli Dhaneshwar Maharaj is saying. Okay? How beautiful it is. Thanks to all. May God bless you. May God bless humanity, in fact. May God bless everybody, in fact.